Welcome to howtocookthat.net, the website where you'll find step-by-step -step instructions for recipes ranging from kids' birthday cake decoration through to chicken noodle soup and easy family dinners. For a printable copy of the recipes, simply go to www.howtocookthat.net. Today we're going to look at how to make raspberry and white chocolate cake pops. Now you've rolled your cake pops into nice balls, what you do is melt a little bit of chocolate, a tiny bit in the bottom of a bowl, then grab your stick, swirl your stick in the chocolate, and then put the stick into, not all the way through, but about probably two thirds of the way through into your cake pop. And then you allow that chocolate to set. And that acts as glue holding the cake ball to the stick so that then when you dip it into the chocolate later it doesn't fall off. Get one of your cake pops, dip it in, make sure you don't stir it round and round because the cake pop will fall off. Just tilt it from side to side to make sure it's fully enclosed and fully covered. Gently lift it up, hold it like this and just tap to let the excess chocolate drip off. Once you're happy that it's stopped dripping, then pop it in your stand. This is just a piece of wood with holes drilled in it. Decorating cake pops is limited only to your imagination. You can add things like your silver balls individually on top if you want to put them in a specific place and don't just want to dip it in as the balls are quite pricey. You can pipe on patterns, just a swirl is an easy one to swirl the cake pop around while you're holding the piping bag. You can of course do that in dark chocolate as well. The other thing that looks quite nice is just a sort of filigree sort of pattern over the cake pop. Just make it up as you go along little swirls. The other thing which can look good is just some little dots all over the cake pop. For weddings it's also nice to uh, pipe some hearts all over the cake pop. I like it white on white because it looks quite classy but you can of course do your dark chocolate if you want to contrast. If you need a recipe for the actual cake bit of the cake pops, just go to howtocookthat.net and there's a recipe there for the chocolate ones and raspberry and white chocolate ones as well.